go slip on a trip What's up guys? Welcome back to another video on my channel. I'm Kendall B. If you're new here, if you're not, what's up? I'm filming on my phone right now because I did not even plan on um, filming this, but we are literally still in our search. That's why you guys have not heard anything about apartments. We are still on our search for our next home and the time is ticking. We have like a few more weeks. And I'm gonna show you guys this apartment we're in right now. Of course not the outside. Of course I'm not giving the name, so please don't ask for the name. And don't get mad at me for not giving the name of where I'm going to stay. So I'm gonna show y'all from the beginning. Hopefully y'all can see me and it's not blurry. So when you first walk in, it has like, it looks like a little like smart lock a little bit. Did she say you can open this with your phone? Huh? Yeah, you can open it with your phone, which I think is pretty cool. Um, right when you come into the left is a storage closet. I love the clean white look of it. And the entryway is super duper wide, if you can see, it's very open. So this is the view when you first come in kitchen is to the right and the kitchen is a nice size with a lot of counter space has this clean white look it does not have ambient lighting under it which I was looking for but I do love the counter space and the cabinets the fridge is bigger than what we have now does it have the water dispenser yes need that we don't have to buy water need that I actually really like this um freezer here is the is the sink it's a deeper sink with a newer dishwasher and of course the flat top stove wow. here hold this um to the left of the kitchen is this built-in shelving which can be used for decor storage mainly a mix of decor and storage and then the living room is a really nice open space that can be used for a desk area on top of putting a couch and a TV. I love how open it is. Look at all this space, y'all. Don't play with it. Balcony is over here to the left and the balcony is actually pretty spacious. Let me show you really quick. This is the start of the balcony. It's kind of like angled. And the rest of the balcony goes all the way down there. It smells really bad out here. Coming over here. Does these lights turn on? Oh yeah, they do. There we go, that's a better look. That's the living room and kitchen. Over here is the bedroom. The bedroom is angled because just how this floor plan is like on the do you have to slam the door like that? <sighs> the bedroom is angled because this unit is like a corner unit because I mean, the shape is giving corner. So here is the bedroom. I love it. Our bed could go there. Baby area can go over here. Lots of space in it. Got a little window, just a little lighting. I do really want a lot of lighting. I want a lot of lighting. So that's another thing to consider. So. Ceiling fan. The room is really huge, which we need. This is 840 square feet, I'm thinking. I know it's 800 something. Closet. Of course, we would be sharing the closet. We definitely can make it work because it has so much storage in here. And attached to the room is the bathroom, which we don't have right now, but it opens up for the guests. So you walk in, there is me, Kendall B. I just got off of work. 
and we're Tory. Period. Over here is the tub. It is a very deep garden tub, a toilet, and right here is a built-in organization for your laundry and bathroom storage. I love how everything is like, the shelving is built in like that because it helps a lot. So we got that. Oh, let me keep that one. Also has the built-in door hooks. That's a plus. And this opens up to the kitchen. So it's kind of like a little tiny hallway. You get the laundry room. And I love that this laundry room has the Whirlpool, a really nice washer and dryer. Is washer and dryer included? Do you know? Okay. That's that. Which is just a utility closet. And then lastly, it has a storage closet, a coat closet. Let me know what you guys think about this one. I really like it. Shocked me, I'm not gonna lie, and the price is really good. So we are gonna go on to our next um, option for the um Okay. I like this little area when you come in. This is the second apartment we are looking at. This is 750 square feet. When you come in, it's kind of like a little space. As you can possibly put a desk, and to the right is the kitchen. And the kitchen will come with all the appliances and the room is working. Mm -hmm. Love the stove. Love the stove. Um, this apartment does only have the kitchen on one wall, which is kind of different, but it's a lot newer than the last one we toured, so. That's that, and then here is the washer and dryer. Do they all come side by side, or do some come stacked? Um, both of them come stacked, or uh, two of them come side by side option, but they'll both be side Okay. Is this the exact unit that's for sale? Um, we do have this unit available, but um, this particular unit is pricing at 1824. We do have this kind of layout um, at 1749, but it wouldn't come with this package. We have the model contract and the um, full package. Okay. This is the bedroom, two windows. I do like the two window thing, but I feel, I still feel like this apartment is super small and we need a lot more space for the baby, so. Let's see how the light is. Let me see the bedroom. It has a ceiling fan. Um, oh, I like this. Closet is nice and big. Closet is nice and able to be shared. He's up on my side. He can have his side. Come like it to the room. And then over here is the what? Look at the shower. Okay, this is different. We're gonna have a baby, so I mean, I don't know how this tub is gonna work out. But this is a stand-up shower. I guess the whole floor can get wet, so the bathroom is huge. It's like a handicap bathroom, huh? Yeah, because I got the things like that. So 
Let's see this there. It's very bright, but I never saw that before. That must be the handicap shower. I'm sorry about that. What you think about it? I love the look of it, of course. I just had to go crack now on my 